I'm a photographer, a filmmaker, I'm a cyclist. I'm very hyperactive. I'm always doing something. I guess when I was first getting into it, I was a little bit inspired by Hollywood style movies, but I'd much rather get into more real life type stuff. Documentaries that look cinematic though, whether it be something related to journalism or something related to sports. I think the most exciting part about filmmaking is being in with the action. I have a, a video that I did with this guy that rides a freeboard. I was like chasing him with the camera, like down the road as he's like skating down the street. People always ask me when they see the video, they're like, were you in a car, were you on a bike? No, I was running with the guy. Starting the school here, I went in with the mindset of like, okay, I want to be a camera operator, I want to be a cinematographer. It wasn't just that, you know, I went through sound classes, lighting classes, directing classes, even acting classes. Over the course of time here at the school, I've kind of fallen into more of a leadership position where we're working together and doing a collaboration, you know, everybody has different roles. I've kind of been placed into that role of being the director. I guess it's a little taste of being in the industry. You're all working towards one common goal. 20 to 30 years from now is, is a long, long time wait. I can hardly even picture like <laughs> one month from now what I'm gonna be doing. Now that I'm in my final year at the academy, I feel like I'm ready to move to the next step into the professional world and start putting those skills to use. I definitely think that I would be looking back a lot to my experiences now at the Academy of Art. And I think I would definitely be proud that I had followed through the whole program and, and gotten the degree, because it's best to go through the classes and to really take in as much information as you can and to have those experiences.